Fab integration for Unreal Engine is live. Importing mega scans and other items can be done by simply drag and dropping them into our scene. Let me show you how to do that. Welcome to Unreal Arc Wizard. On this channel, we are all about pushing the line between CGI and reality. Let's hope that Fab will be a great tool for that. To be able to just drag and drop mega scans, we have to install Fab integration first. So after you have claimed all of your mega scans, open Epic Games Launcher, go to Library, scroll down to Fab Library, and search for Fab. If you don't see it, try restarting the launcher. When you hover over this icon you will see it's compatible with Unreal Engine 5.3 and higher. Click install to engine and you will be able to pick your Unreal Engine version here. I have already it installed so I'll continue and then start your project. Once inside of your project go to window Click on Fab, now click on your icon in the top right corner and log in. And now come back to your project. So, we are inside of Fab, but I want to filter only for Quixel assets. How do I do that? I search for Quixel. If you hover over any item, you will see in the upper left corner there is Publisher. So just find Quixel and click on it. We can import assets into our scenes in two ways. The first is by clicking on it, choosing the quality version and click add to project. The asset was automatically added to your content folder. You can find it by opening Fab, going to Megascans and locating it in here. Now I can use this in my scene. But we can also just drag and drop free assets into our scene directly. To do it, find an asset with a, an icon of a hand over it, like this, and just drag and drop it into your scene. It will start downloading it once it's done, you can see the asset is inside of your scene. Right now, there's actually no way to choose quality setting before you drag and drop it, but I have noticed that it remembers the last quality setting you had. So if I were to pick medium quality, go back, find this asset again, it will import the medium quality now. And if I go for to the next object, it will remember that I want medium quality assets and it will import the medium quality again. So yeah, you can see 2K textures, 2K is medium quality, 4K high quality and raw quality is usually 8K. What's pretty cool is that you can do it not only with mega scans, but with any free assets on the store. Now, if I would add this item to my library and find it in here, you will notice I actually don't see this hand icon. So it's currently not possible to drag and drop items from your library. What we have to do right now, unfortunately, is to go to search, find the item there and then drag and drop it from here. Hopefully a solution for it will be out soon. At least they are aware of this problem and they promise to work on it. When it comes to packs, we cannot drag and drop them into our scene, so we will have to go ahead and add to project. There is one issue with it though. It doesn't actually check for what Unreal Engine version you are using. So for example, I had a 5.3 version running, but this asset actually supports 5.4 only. So it added all of those files to my project, even though I wasn't able to use them. Before adding a pack to your project, just make sure you have a matching Unreal Engine version. Having seamless integration of mega scans into our workflow helps a lot with realism. But in my experience, the clouds can often make or break the render. And the default Volmatio clouds are just not good enough. If you want to learn how to animate beautiful clouds in different weather conditions for free, check out this tutorial of mine. Hope to see you there. Ciao!